rib raising to stimulate sympathetic activity. For this technique, the patient is laying supine and the physician may be standing or seated as I am on the affected side. The patient's arm is moved away from the angles of the ribs and the physician's hands make contact with the angles of the ribs through the fingertips. For this technique, the physician will apply anterior and lateral traction to the angle of the rib. The physician makes contact with the angle of the rib and applies anterior and lateral traction using the elbows and the forearms as a fulcrum to lever and enhance the motion that is being applied. The patient may take deep breaths in and out to enhance the technique. This technique is repeated three to five times for each set of ribs. The physician may reposition their hands to different ribs based on the position of the dysfunction. Once completed, the patient is returned to neutral position and reassessed for normalization of function.